I've always been captivated by moving water. Uh, ever since I was a boy, I've been drawn to rivers. I just found something magical about them. They had this incredible mix of power and grace and vitality. I feel very fortunate to have spent so much of my life on rivers, but uh, I've also seen enough to make me fearful about what lies ahead for all waterways. There is a joke in China. They say that you can predict the it color for the season by looking at the color of the river. If you travel where most of the world manufactures, you end up with having rivers that are turning blue. In the last 40, 50 years, we've seen massive industrialization, and that's been done with a full acknowledgement of what that will do to the environment. If you see how people are living there, they have lost their sensory adaptation. They can't smell anymore. You don't learn the details because at the end of the day, it's not a selling point. You as a consumer, you have the right to ask the brand that you're wearing where the jean came from. If you have two jeans, one is damaging the planet, the other one not, and the price is the same, no one will choose the wrong one. I mean, there is no excuse. I think all corporations have to be accountable for their environmental practices, and no one, no one has a right to damage or destroy a river.